you're hearing a lot of buzz about 4K HDR. What the heck does that even mean? <laughs> well, those are actually two different technologies. 4K, of course, being a greater pixel count, higher resolution. Been around for several years, and that looks really terrific, particularly on larger screens. HDR it stands for high dynamic range, which started out as a photography term. The net of that is it's a brighter picture, greater contrast. Whites are whiter, blacks are blacker, reds are redder, and it brings out more detail in both in the foreground as well as in the background. And it enhances not only a 4K picture on a large screen, but it also enhances a smaller screen. So whereas 4K, in my opinion, you mostly need the larger screen to see that great impact, HDR is visible really on any size screen. So we're about in the market for a new TV. Is this something that I need to go run out and buy tomorrow? Well. I might be watching the trends a little bit. Um, I've shopped a little bit for HDR. It's pretty expensive right now, but that's frankly part of what we want to see here at CES is just exactly what momentum is building for HDR and coming down those cost curves. There's no question in my mind that it will be a fabulous improvement. It will deliver to our customers over an IP path. So. Here again, you get that convergence of the video world and the IP world, and this will be broadband delivered. So there's a, a linkage there that's going to be very important to us as a company and to our customers.